liked how you, uh, I liked how you revealed you Domino. That. that was awesome. Oh yeah, right? Zazie, she's great. Did you have that made? Like the um, Zazie Beats thing that you put on the Instagram? Wait, the, the Domino one yeah. or the other one? No, like the, do the one that okay. had her name in Domino. Right. Oh, my wife did that just like Excuse me? two minutes before. Can I have your name and outlet, please? Yeah, Kevin McCarthy, Washington, D.C. And we are rolling. By the way, uh, I brought you guys something because you know I love Deadpool. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, I know you liked it, too. Thank you and so much. Oh, oh, cool, 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 cool. I really, that's great. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Somebody, somebody from Sony yeah. is coming in right yeah. now. <laughs> Where's my Forgot. Deadpool talk now? <laughs> Oh, By yes, the way, awesome. I, I like how your names are on the chairs. It yeah, says right? Jake and Russell. So you guys know. know which chair to sit in. No, we're in. idiots. Yeah, yeah, right. Let's be honest. This is amazing. We're fools. idiots. I, I literally <laughs> sat in that yeah, chair yeah. when I first came really? and they were like, oh, what's wrong? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> totally, totally, totally. All right, I, I got to nerd out with you guys. Yeah. Because I was freaking out about Daniel's continuous tracking shot in the opening scene. And I had recently just seen your video that Carrie Fukunaga did yeah. where you were singing and it was one shot. What's up, dude? I'm just oh, wondering what it looks like. It looks painful. What, is that, that hurt? Fine. That looks good. Really oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I'm wondering when you guys shoot those scenes, what does it look like for you on set? And are you actually doing it? Go ahead. There we go. But that's, that's the, the, really the, the continuous oh, shots okay. are amazing. And I'm wondering for actors how you like what that means for you as an actor to do a shot like that. Obviously, Fukunaga did it with your uh, mm -hmm. amazing Broadway shot. Talk about what you guys look like on set. Are you on wires moving around? How does that work? Yeah, I love big wonners. That's always they're always like a. a Huge technical challenge. It does sound big, really weird. Big love big wonders. I love big wonders, man. That's the best thing to do in a movie. Is that what you call it? Inside baseball here. Well, it's a one shot. One yeah, shot. So a it's a big wonder. Big wonder. It's a big one. <laughs> it's also pillow, pillow talk with my wife. Flush that yeah. down. <laughs> um, <laughs> just I mean, nailed that big wonder. <laughs> nailed the big tour. Blake, <laughs> big wonder. One down. <laughs> Um, What's the tour? I mean, that's what, that's, go that's in there! Really well, technically, the tour is the like... one you want to be... <laughs> anyway, let's just... Hey, fuckers. Let's get it together, or let's get out of fuck town, all right? This is all, all right. I need. I'm just, I'm just gonna go. That's all, that's, all right. I'm good, I'm You're good. good, right? No, no. Oh, um, no. Um, but yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, fuckers, let's get it together. Get fuck this is such a useless uh, interview. It's so great. This right, is right. totally, you have nothing I'm useful I'm going to ask here. a useful God. interview. A useful question. The next here we go. Google question is going to be like, are, is Ryan Reynolds high? Yeah. That's what it's going to be. That's do, like, why does Ryan Reynolds like, require his name on here? Like, so I mean, when there's just two to choose from. So many contracts. The guy that put this on here was like, so how, high are, how high are they? Yeah, like, no. By the way, how the next yours? interviewer comes on, I'm taking mine yeah, off, yeah, and you keep yours all game. It's just like oh, Brian always needs his name designated for the chair. Name oh, well, after Deadpool's success, he's like, you know what? I have to have this my name on the chair. This is just for the interviews. Look, okay, this, this is, is right. not hand. Can I, can I wear the Why Ryan? Why isn't this hand embroidered? I want to wear the Ryan sticker. Yeah, I yeah. Well, no, I, I might need. The, you were talking about the one shot. The one right? shot. Yeah. The one shot's really Thanks. interesting, Ryan. Seriously, come Sorry, on. No, no, no. We're no, talking about the one shot. We're talking about the big one. It's all about. It's all about really being able to. Thank you, yeah. Jake. Oh, right on his heart. That. Too. Great on his yeah. heart. Yeah. Yeah. Really. yeah, I see Jake's closer. Sure. Yours is just a really worked out pet. Jake's Jake's is yeah. Been, yeah. Thank yeah. you. Where's but Where's your nightcrawler tie pin? It's so fun. It's this so is true. Fun. I have an enemy tie pin. It's so fun to do one <laughs> shot. God, can we keep this serious? It's what it's supposed to do. It's, it's really great because it's all choreography and it, everyone's tense about getting it right and making sure that everything works in the same moment. Yeah. And like you're dealing with like a hundred different crew members making sure one thing works. And so there's like a high tension. And a lot of stakes in moments like mm -hmm. that and to me it's so cool it's the closest thing to like live theater that you can do where everything you do cannot be edited and everyone relies on each other yeah, yeah. and it feels it's pretty fun because that and it's also great when you see, you see it on the call sheet they're saying they have three days to shoot one shot right like, yeah well, how is this possible yeah. and you realize it's something well because like like, ryan is to memorize his lines yes which takes like he had like yeah. three lines oh. and it took him like three and a half days yes, yes. yes. with somebody when he goes off helmet. camera he's like actually looking yeah. at his next line he never wore a helmet I, yeah. No, I'm just looking at like interpretive uh, images. <laughs> I don't actually read anything. I haven't read anything since I was a child. This is, oh, this is interesting. Yeah. And thank you for the reanimator joke, by the way. Oh yes, was you're that a welcome. And, and uh, that's, was a, that you? that's a Rhett Reese Paul Warnick. Line. I had a feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a yeah, great yeah. line. Yeah, Because yeah. they did a lot of that in Deadpool. They right? You did it. too. They so. love it. But there was a one great moment in the shoot when we first actually second day of shooting or something like that. We we're in that scene where he's getting his hand, you know, broken. Yeah. Not him, but Aaron. And and Ryan is looking through the through the glass. And I'm behind him, and he turns in the middle, and he goes, 
we're all gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't stop saying that. Just oh, like wow. yeah. when I couldn't stop laughing. That yeah. was very good. Was like, I yeah. say it at home all the time yeah. as well. Yeah. Like, yeah. All the time. <laughs> Every time someone wakes Guys, up. And the truth is, we are all gonna die. Yeah. Yeah. Great to Guys, talk to you. It was, yeah. aw- it was yeah. awesome to talk to you. Uh, congratulations um, on this film. Well, thank you very much. Yes, and welcome back to Earth uh, to both of you guys. Thank you very much. When you're making the movie, do you know what Calvin looks like during the filming? Um, no. Uh, he did. I didn't. Mostly because I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, he it works. W- it was right in front of me, and I still didn't see it. Um, in, in, in the, it looked a little bit like uh, we knew that it looked like a um, sort of a. Um, an exclamation of snot initially, yeah. but then uh, we it, yeah. it, it grows and uh, then it just started to for me it just started to legitimately look like Ryan, yeah. like and and it was in our imaginations of the things that we feared, and so that was the first thing that I, you know, go to. Exactly, I am the go to like, alien model in Hollywood. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if it's a, if it's something that you fear, what was it for you then? Was well, something that you fear? Well, oh, that's what Jake said. Yeah, all thirty-seven Muppets. Oh, yeah, yeah. terrifying. Yeah, just like swap them out. Like, Grover! Oh, God! Oh, God. Are the puppets on Sesame Street considered Muppets? Yes. I'm back now. Um, <laughs> They're, I mean, I would say, like, yeah. I mean, but Fraggle Rock. There's a gray, there's a fine mm. line there. Because those dudes are chilling in caves and rocks. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. Sm- mind you, miniature ones, but still. So it's like oh, a toss up. All I see is someone flashing two minutes behind your head. <laughs> this poor guy going, I've got not, I haven't had one question answered in this entire interview. But I will say, like, Fraggle Rock is extraordinary. <laughs> and when you think about, uh, like, like other forms and other li- life, you know, of other kinds, when we were children, that show made me start to sort of understand the idea that there could be life outside of Earth. Yeah. See how you brought it all the, the way back us, around right? there. So, And to answer your actual question, maybe the only question you'll get answered. Why are you Perhaps, doing that? Uh, what? No. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. Sorry. Just Hold on a second. Don't do I just that. throw you under the bus? Yeah. I apologize. <laughs> how do the tires taste? Okay, pretty good? Yeah. Lightweight or heavy duty yeah. truck? Anyway. Yeah. Fuck me. Let's go um, fuck down. Yeah. <laughs> Can't use that. I don't. Um, a lot of bleeps. Oh yeah, maybe. Um, the the no, we didn't know what the alien looked like, uh, but we're still answering this question. But, but <laughs> the alien behaves and reacts to each character differently. Like my character yeah. meets the alien with violence. The char- the alien meets my character with violence. Um, Jake's character is curious. The alien is kind of curious about Jake. So it's it's uh it's interesting. This it's not like overtly hostile. It, we bring this thing on board, and the first thing it sees is probably the most terrifying thing anyone could see, which is you know a bunch of humans so it's just trying to survive so there's something interesting about this thing that's not it's not like you know inherently evil uh as we bring it on board it's just trying to survive is there a secret to making the floating in space look authentic um oh boy because it looks like you never realize you guys are on wires we had a a movement coach um uh, alex reynolds who's amazing she worked with um Eddie Redmayne on The Theory of Everything and a number of movies with him in terms of his physicality and she works with the physicality of character Mm -hmm. and she was always on the lookout in every take we did of the the movement not just from how it looks in space but also how specifically each one of our characters would move based on our background so um, after every take we were being we were shown like either shown or explained to what didn't feel right so um, we're constantly honing in on what felt like zero gravity and looked like zero gravity. While we're flying around on wires, obviously you never really know. Sometimes you don't really pay attention to where your legs are. Very yeah. often, yeah. <laughs> she'd come up to me and be like, "You, you look like you're taking a nap with your yeah. like your legs would would do this or something." And then I'd have to redo it. Legs again. are around Ryan's neck. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Yeah. I have so many Fraggle Rock questions. Actually, not on set. I'm sorry. Guys, well, good to see you again, Ryan. You I always. can't believe we've never met. I know. Here, we're, thank God. Yeah, finally, will, sincere musical swells right now. And he will make, <laughs> make you feel at contact. the end of the interview like you will never have wanted to anyway. So let's good <laughs> luck. Let's make a baby <laughs> later. Okay. So welcome to Texas, guys. You're oh. in my backyard. Thank you. Two yeah, of you guys nice to be here. wearing colorful shirts, right? And just it, partying. I'm down. proud. We got the, we got the memo. I'll loan yeah. him. I'll loan. I'll loan out our friendship for a little while if you want. If you guys want to chill, I appreciate that. I don't mind taking a little break. Yeah. This guy has haute couture. <laughs> Invest in our chilling. 
I'm yeah. like, We're do you like Texas. my collar in this shirt? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's talk a little bit Literally, of this I've movie. I spent the live. entire day trying to keep it down. No, with 100% like, more collar. My <laughs> question. <laughs> Come on, guys. I, I just want to ask this one question. Yeah. Should we be <clears throat> Should we be scared when we go see this film? Well, I, mean, you, I don't know. You should be, but you will be. You will be. Yeah. I was terrified. I'm just curious. You will when be you terrified. see the script, you get the script, you read it. Were you guys like, wow, this is? I mean, I I love the movie. I really really liked it. Mom saw it. You know, mom. No way. Of course. She was like sweaty palms the oh, whole that's time. Good. She's that's like, good. This is that's good. That's what you stuff. want. Did he get bruises on your arms? For bruises, doing this, absolutely. Bruises on your arms are always a good sign. But you know it's what I mean? oh, yeah. like this. But technically, that's child abuse, though. If your mom's bruising you, even now, <laughs> that's then true. you can report, I report, her. Take I reported her. her. You Just can take her to court. Yeah. But, I mean, what is it about this story that intrigues us that makes us think, hey, we need to be afraid? This movie will make you take your mom to court. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Feeling litigious. That's good, yeah. <laughs> See life. See the life movie. Um, yeah, it'll. Well, it, it, I think the suspense is just something that, that people love, and suspense is something that I love, and those kinds of films that are thrilling. And they freak you out and scare the crap out of you. I love that stuff, you know. And totally. This is this is one of those movies. What about the uh, weightless? I can't say that word. Weightless. Zero gravity. That's yeah. it. Zero weightlessness. Geez. There it is. Yeah. When you guys were filming that, tell me I, without giving secrets, I guess, but or maybe you will. I know when you I'll tell you anything. You yeah, actually, know. you will. It's the shirt that'll do it. Right. hundred. This but, guy. No, I the, like that the shirt. Guy that wears by the shirt way. like this. Like this will lie to you. <laughs> <laughs> now that he mentioned, yeah. he called attention to. Him. I'm like, dude, that's kind of a. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you kidding me? I'm like weightlessness. Wait. <laughs> the thing about <laughs> weightlessness <laughs> is um, a concept. It's a little bit like being a vampire. Yeah, it's a little bit. Um, <laughs> or Bela Lugosi. We should just go full serious for the rest of this. Thing. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Okay, the rest of this interview is going to be fully serious. No, I don't. <laughs> Can I show you what the beginning of full series is? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, this is what it is. Oh yeah, yeah. It's yeah. always cross legs. Well. And you've yeah, done that it's, before it's when we've talked. Is that go what back. you were doing? Go back, I, John. Yeah. Go Pull back. those tapes. When the movie's not fun, yeah. but it's serious, right. it's this. Yeah. When the movie's fun, is going to terrify the crap out of you. It's just We're this. We're like, We're just relaxed. Fun, yeah. And okay. there's a shirt like that. Yeah. That's what Which is yeah, pretty terrifying is. as is. a confident I I uh, wardrobe decision. Yeah. All right, I got to get this in. Let's yeah. say, if you, would you be afraid to go into space like in real life? I know it's a movie and you're there. Yes. So, but would you? I wouldn't do it. I just wouldn't do it. I agree. Would you do I it? Like real space space? Yeah. Would you just Not go like, out there like on a mission? Uh, you're from Texas, man. You're dude. from where the Earth. You want to be on the Earth in the ground. Thank yeah, you, sir. Also, you know the I mean? launching pad for almost every space exploration. So true. <laughs> that's, so that's this true. is a bit of a juxtaposition that's there. True, yeah. yeah. But would you? I mean, would you? Would you need uh, solid Earth no, to man. get up there. You need yeah, right. solid you need Earth. Solid. You know? <laughs> I'm I, sorry. I, no, I'm staying. I'm staying. I'm gonna, staying. I'm 40. I've had a good run. I think I'm gonna just finish it out here. He says he's actually 67. Yeah. Well, <laughs> it's the shirt. Just Watch this face right here. Yeah. <laughs> oh God. No. <laughs> I love it. So guys, my first question for you after uh, experiencing everything in this you movie. Go. Uh, if there's an alien life form, which one of you is going to approach it? Approach the alien life yeah. Do not approach the a alien life form. No. I mean, I'm pretty much close to it. Yeah. As close as you can it's get It's a fine right line now. between approaching it and shoving your friend into it. It's fair. Yeah. <laughs> it's fair. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. So I took a few questions from Twitter. I asked people to send them to My me. My arm is burning from what, where you touched me. Really? Is, that, is there like a no. salicylic acid you <laughs> used or something to stay young looking? What happens there? Wow. Yeah. Is, that might be the alien uh, life form. First, oh, first no, 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 that's better. That's no, better. It was just me. I'm sensitive. Okay. That's just your. That's just your rage. I'm a human yeah. jewel, son. Um, okay. Let's so, get serious, Brandon. This cause... question, very serious, uh, comes from Wimps Mojo. Did you guys experience uh, zero gravity training? Well, Ryan tends to suck the atmosphere out of a room, so I do. every press junket I do um, with Ryan, it feels like we're in zero gravity. It does so feel a little bit that is, zero gravity. You know. Sort of sensory deprivation thing I like to do to all of also, my hosts. Also, zero personality. Zero. Oof, I mean, it seems like it's a tough true. set. Zero, uh, zero, zero gravity, zero personality. 100%. Yeah. A lot of gravity, actually. Yeah. Speaking of personality, of this hair. one, actually, real tweet, <laughs> comes from Harvey. It's for Jake. Ryan, you might be able to answer. Uh, at Comic Book Now, how annoying is Ryan Reynolds on set? Wow. That's from Harvey. Harvey, Jesus Christ. It's from Harvey Weinstein. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Harvey stuff Weinstein might actually say that. <laughs> <laughs> on a scale of one to I'm leaving, don't follow me, <laughs> what would you say? How annoying is Ryan on set? <laughs> that was, that's Harvey's question. Like, honestly, Harvey, um, if you are the rabbit that I think you are, um, you know the movie, right? Anybody? Rabbit Proof Fence. Harvey? Oh, Harvey, of okay. course. He's, anyway. a he's a puka. Yeah. yeah big so, six foot six uh, imaginary rabbit. Yeah, I would say he's really not annoying at all. He's like, he's actually the best, uh, he's the best personality on set, and he makes everybody feel pretty great, and his energy, which I deeply believe in, 
is like infects the whole in like a in like a like a sort of like in like a very like think about think about like an epidemic um like a like um, (laughs) of mass proportions yeah that's what his personality is like okay but positive but positive oh good no no no. i don't think that's the answer harvey wanted no but harvey wanted like (laughs) ryan reynolds and (laughs) the horse he came in his family and let them all go back back to place yeah Yeah. Yeah. i was kind of had a moment and then you took it there yeah, I don't know. I mean, you know, he, you know, Har- Harvey's I, participating in the internet hate tank. I, I can't help that. So, buddy, you're taking this on a, in a, like the totally the wrong way. Harvey loves you. He I love just, Harvey. He just wants to know how annoying you can be. Yeah, dude, he's not annoying car. at all. This man is like uh, a gentleman and a really good man, and we could all learn a lot from him. And that's the truth. Okay. Wow. Now uh, this one comes from Brandon Davis. BD. That's that's me. Mm-hmm. Uh, who's a better kisser, Andrew Garfield or Jake? Mm. <laughs> Deep oh, down, that's really deep tough. down, yeah. Yeah. and he's not talking about love making, bro. No, no, he's no, just no, talking no, about no, kissing. No. Well, Jake's weird because Jake's got an opposable thumb on his tongue, which isn't normal for a lot of people. So, uh, yeah, there's a that's joint good. in there, I think, as well. Not the kind you smoke. Come handy. Uh, he thinks it's my tongue, but it's the back of my neck. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Andrew Garfield is just—I mean—he's cheating because he's just got some weird tractor beam. He's just a normal Couldn't person. <laughs> What makes this movie different than any other movie? Well, I don't know how many outer space movies do you know oh, that contain 100% real Jake Gyllenhaal. <laughs> so we're getting 100%. You're getting 100%. 100%, 100%, 100% not, not 50. high grade, uh-huh. American made American Jake made. Gyllenhaal. You're getting one thick slab of You are Ryan getting Reynolds. a big old thick one slab big, of a Canadian ham. One slab of Canadian <laughs> right ham known yep. as Ryan mm-hmm. Rambo Reynolds. Yeah, that's, Thinking steak tartare raw. That's the, oh, yeah. that's the door. That's, that's I'll the door. Right. Hold on one second. <laughs> Either that or the yeah. fire alarm because it's yeah. so hot so in here. That's just the carbon monoxide <laughs> alarm. We're going to be fine. Hey, insider, I need to get outside. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is Blake cool with this bromance? You're not taking time uh, away. I mean, this fine. is an issue. You're experiencing yeah, you're, it. You're, you're, yeah. I mean, Are you cool with this? I mean, I, I mean we were yeah. fine till you showed up. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, were. what's going on? I don't know. She's or, great with it. Okay. You know. Our names rhyme. We're good. Yeah. Anything that, that takes my attention off of her 24 7, she's okay with that. <laughs> Just Can you anything. imagine if we had a cake in the room? It would be oh, like a God, rhyming man, nightmare. Can get my face in that cake. <laughs> Blake Jake. Jake Cake. I'm sure Ryan's wife Blake Lively supports his relationship with Jake all the way. Woo! Cue Instagram. <laughs> so in the spirit of the movie and their bromance, we played a game called Blake or Jake. Who would you rather have a lifeline on who wants to be a millionaire? Who knows more? Oh, but Jake for sure. <laughs> Wait, you answered the question when he said, who knows more? But Jake. Had nothing. <laughs> who would you rather have cook a hot meal for you? I'll take uh, Blake with the hot meal, and, and then Jake can serve the, uh, the, the warm one. Okay. Yeah. Who would Another you ra- hot steaming bowl of Jake coming right up. What? <laughs> what? If Jake's name was Blake, yeah. who would you pick as Blake or Jake? <laughs> what? Congratulations on this film. It made me stress out. Good, great. Maybe not want to sit by myself in the theater. Mm-hmm. Thank you. That was so. <laughs> Had to light a lot of candles when you got home that <laughs> night, didn't you? Really did. Yeah. Hanging from, I said strings. Ariane had to tell me they weren't strings. They They're were strings. Was it wires? I know, it sort of makes it sound like, well, they like were like, 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 like meat puppets. <laughs> we're the meat puppets, and they're just... You know, no, let's like be honest. Controlled. Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah, yeah, but in general, if you want to be... Yeah, I'll throw a little on. Any so, accidents? Do this. Any strings break? Anything happen? <clears throat> I, like, there were a number of times I went right into Rebecca's butt. Like, right... Yes, I was true. Literally, I was always behind Rebecca. I was yeah. right <laughs> behind Rebecca all the time. Like, they cut the top out so the wires could come in. So we all, whenever we would travel a lot of times, Sometimes we were split, but usually we were behind each other. Yeah. Face to butt, like, at yeah. least 15 <laughs> times in the movie. <laughs> yep. Are you in the doghouse? Because you had recently said that this man right here made better food than white Did you hear funnily that? Enough, Can you believe I'm, that? Did I'm you hear actually that? Did you living hear that? right now in an actual doghouse. <laughs> That's what uh, this is. <laughs> Baxter's usually staying in there, but uh, he's this? moved out for now. He's up and he's, oh, he's been upgraded Baxter. to the main, the main bed. <laughs> Baxter. Uh, yeah. Um, so you, you know, take it over. wasn't totally in the dog house because they they know they have a kind of a like a they get competitive like with the, Is it, co- they're, like both, they're both very incredibly competing? accomplished chefs. It's exactly so. like chopped. It's like chopped. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Kind of exactly so this is like, like the season yeah. finale is coming up. What is it about his food, or what does he make the best? You do like simple stuff really well. Like like there, I don't know. I'm serious. You made <laughs> like cheese. salmon and steak. Like those kinds of things are like really good. No, not yeah. like I'm like simple. Like bowls of cereal, I would oh, do very okay. well. And like without the milk. But no, he's he's very good at like yeah the staples like the. You hear 
he's making these faces. You hear his praises for you. Do you yeah. praise him? What do you he's actually him? gone through his full catalog of facial expressions just in that last <laughs> I, sentence. I think right I may there. have, actually. He used all two of them. <laughs> uh, yeah. They've got me pretty far. This, they this, have, this, yeah. Thus yeah. far, I've right. yeah. no, 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 stop! Whoa! <laughs> What's it's happening all here? happening yeah. right now. Right? Um, yeah. He's going to uh, think his praise for you. What's, what's your pra- praise? Praise for like him? Praising him. Yeah, he yeah, praised yeah. your food. Don't, this is, don't fall for this trap. What's super this frustrating about We've been asked, been asked this question a couple of times, and it's like he's always, it's very specific. What is the good stuff he cooked? Then then someone throws me out into deep water. Say something nice no, about him. Not like specific. Right. Like, shoes, just say nice something like, nice about him. First of all, no matter what I say, I'm going to sound like I'm not telling the truth. Yeah, you aren't. Well, Please, I'm the one who committed to honesty in this interview. They don't interview. need to know about They don't know about it. I mean, his shirt. We, can we say you like his shirt? He hates this shirt. Have you seen the guy's calves? Yeah. He was like, what's on there oh, right his, now? Your calves are uh, amazing. Well, they are quite, I mean, they are quite incredible. <laughs> I mean, let's okay. be honest. His Wait. Achilles and his calves are unmatched. Unreal. Yeah. And I, I do have heard... an impressive thorax. I mean, he can... <laughs> Because, like, I am unapproachable in these interviews, usually. So yeah. they're just like, what's yeah. going what on with Joe and all? Yeah. It's Reynolds. Do you think, really? No, yeah. I, it's low yeah. grade street drugs. <laughs> that, that's, that explains. No, because those do. That sounds like a, a logical explanation. I don't yeah. Know. But, but, you know, I heard. You know, I want to get to the movie really quick because. I you better. I, I, <laughs> yeah, I, know. Uh, yeah. I, I have to say, I think it's good for people to walk in there knowing it's not what you expect. The yeah. whole thing when it ends, you know? I, but yes. you don't give away the ending. Yeah. But is that what kind of attracted you, that part of it? I, I like, I think it's a sort of filmmaker's responsibility to, to be unexpected in films, you know, to, to do things that you don't think they're going to do, to have the guts to kind of, you know, um, show an audience things that they're they're not used to seeing. So I think Daniel really succeeded in that. I think it's one of the reasons why life is so ter- terrifying, because, you know, this this film is doing and saying things that you wouldn't normally see in a science fiction film. Yeah. So, And it keeps you on the edge of your seat. You never know what's going to happen, and, you know, you never who, know who's going to get it next. You never know what, and so it's, it's well, pretty... Pretty wild. That's what I was going to ask you next, because it doesn't matter on, on billing or whatever. Usually a movie, it's so predictable because you, you guys were, would be both in the top billing of a film. You expect... There's no there's no red there, shirt. There, there, there's no, no Star Trek guy with the red shirt. Exactly. Where, they all, where they all go down to the visit the planet, and there's like, you know, like Sulu, McCoy, Spock, Kirk, and... Henry. <laughs> no, no, there isn't that in this movie. There's also like very that. strong women ca- uh, character. Oh, sorry. sorry, that was characters. God. Um, yeah. So you know, to me, that was really interesting too. That really the strongest characters in this movie are the women. Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah. I, and I, I personally, you know, we need more of that. Yeah. Um, and I know both of us agree with that together, like wholeheartedly. So it was interesting to be in a movie where you know. Um, the, the the leads of the movie in a lot of ways are are the women. Yeah, that's interesting that you're you're that's a you're advocating for that. You know, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I don't know I, when I think I don't know how you feel, but working, being able to work in this business for as long as I've been lucky enough to do it, like I, um, you know, I I feel blessed but I also feel like you have an opportunity to do things and tell stories and to take certain types of risks you know if you maintain this idea generally like like this weird hierarchy of like this person needs to be the to lead and their name needs to be bigger or yeah. whatever it doesn't I mean that's why I really I adore this guy is because that doesn't never comes into play mm-hmm. no I, he feels like lucky to be there always and is good to people and he lets me see that I shouldn't behave the way I normally do, which is just <laughs> wow, awful. And no, wow. no. But honestly, like I, I think that that's it's important. You know, you have an opportunity to make movies and be in them and be able to do, tell stories and th- do things that you really care about. And to me, I think there should be more roles for women and more men who support that. Yeah, that's, and we also shouldn't even be in a situation where we're patting ourselves on the back for having like the, the commander of the ISS is is a woman from Russia. Absolutely. Like I love I love yeah. things like that, and I think those things Absolutely. are important. But at the same time, they but should just be. Wrote. You know, what? I'm just patting you on the back, just generally. Oh, you were. thanks. Oh, I thought you needed burping. Oh no, Sorry. no, thank you. I oh, also okay. do need no big. Well. Okay, it cool. sounds like you've changed him somehow. <sighs> but who can say he, he's like... been changed for the better? <laughs> but you know he's been changed for good. It's wicked. It's quite oh, a wicked oh, cool. Right there. Well, I thought you might cool. catch on to that, even a guy that you're a theater guy. <laughs> oh. Anyway, um, so <laughs> speaking about how there's an equality and there should be no competition, I'm like, oh, no, it's cool. Just let it go. <laughs> let it go. He's into it. Uh, oh, we'll this is the blow dart room. This is the blow 